on this screencast, we'll show you how to conduct an image search using um, copyright tools that allow you to reuse and modify the image without violating copyright. So this is very important whenever you're using an image in a school project or assignment. So the first thing that I usually do is just go straight to Google and type in whatever I'm going to look for. And then when you've got your results page, you, you have an images option right there. So that's usually how I do the images. You can also go to images.google.com. So once you've narrowed it down to images, you'll want to go over to tools and to usage rights. So there are several different options here on usage rights, like usage rights. The one you want is labeled for non-commercial reuse with modification. That means that you can do anything you want with the image, you can change it, whatever, and that's not an issue. If you're if you know you're absolutely not going to change it, you could use labeled for non-commercial reuse. Now note that these are only valid if you are in fact using them um, in a way that you will not be making money for them. So they're perfect for using in a school project or something, but if you're using it for a business or something like that, like an actual business, not a, a business project where you made up a business, then that would be a problem. Um, if that if that was the case, you would need one of these two, labeled for reuse with modification or labeled for reuse. Um, these will give you a few more results. Um, so they, these are nice when you're using it uh, for school project. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this one, which, um, allows you to modify it as much as you want. And then you can sift through, and you'll see Google actually offers some other ways of looking through it. Um, but you can pick any of these pictures now and use them uh, for whatever that you need them to. And let's say you're looking specifically for pictures of fruit, you can narrow that down that way. And again, all of these, as you can see, are labeled for non-commercial reuse with modification. So as you're preparing any kind of school project, or even if you end up using this for a business, um, you want to check your usage rights to make sure that you're not violating copyright. And it is as simple as that. There are also some other websites that you can use um, that do have Creative Commons licensed images. So that's something that you can look for as well. Um, so that's how you can find some images and not violate copyright.